Today we are talking about the pros and cons of silicone restoration membranes, SRM systems. My name is Ron Perdue with West Riffing Systems. I've been in the riffing business for 30 years. A silicone restoration roof membrane system is a silicone based coating that is applied over top of any single ply membrane to help extend your warranty and longevity of your roof. What affects the cost of a silicone restoration membrane is variables in your existing roof system. Depending on the size of your building, the warranty that you're looking for, the projections, penetrations, all the variables that apply to that in a membrane restoration system affects the cost of what you're going to spend. Roofs that are a good candidate for a SRM system or a roof restoration system are existing roofs that show minimal leaks in the roof, that the membrane is still in good condition where your factory warranty may have ran out within three or five years, and is a system that basically, if you, if you have a ton of leaks on your building, the odds that an SRM system is not going to work, you may be into a total replacement cost at that point. So the candidate that is best described is a roof that you're looking to extend the life of a roof that does not leak to get your, your roof back underneath of a warranty. The installation process of the, the SRM system starts out with a, we come in, we power wash the entire roof, clean the existing membrane. We treat all of the penetrations, projections that are on that roof, and then it gets generally two coats of silicone over top of that. That's that final system. If you're doing a manufacturer's warranty and you want a 20 year warranty, you may have to put multiple coats on the roof to build it up depending on the warranty requirements that you're looking for. As far as the energy savings for an SRM system, you, the biggest benefit is when you're changing a, an existing black rubber roof into a white membrane, which the SRM system is going to convert that color to a white, and which that time you're gonna have reflectivity off of the roof which is going to save you generally in your cooling. As far as the safety for the SRM system, probably the big thing is the installation. If you have intake vents on your, on your building, just maybe some of the smell while you're installing it coming in through those intakes, that should be shut down while you're doing that installation. Other than that, other than yes, it is gonna be a little slippery on the roof, but it really doesn't matter which roof system, if you're on a roof, it, it's a safety issue just being on a roof. So precautions in everything when you're there are, are gonna be the same, whether it's a, a silicone roof, a rubber roof, a TPO roof, a foam roof. It's gonna be the same safety concerns. As far as repairs to an SRM system with the, with the silicone is the, whoever is repairing it has to be a little more cautious as to what they're doing. Uh, being silicone, the only thing that is going to stick to silicone is silicone. So another contractor coming in that doesn't know that system, that tries to put a urethane or an acrylic on top of that system, it will not work, it'll fail. As far as contractor qualifications for a silicone installation, the contractor should be trained by the manufacturer. They should also be, be trained through the SPFA, which deals a lot with the silicone coatings. So if you know your contractor is only as good as the experience they have, so if they're not qualified to put your roof on, they shouldn't be there putting your roof on. Catching your roof before it's too late to do a more cost-effective option on your building. It's, you know, like I said, generally when you call, when you need a new roof, it's because you have leaks. When you have leaks, that means your insulation underneath your membrane is probably already wet. You shouldn't put any roof on, whether it be SRM or a new roof, 
over an existing wet roof because it will fail. To learn more about our silicone restoration membrane system, or to read the pros and cons of silicone restoration membrane article, visit our website at westroofingsystems.com.